everyone and welcome up to this video in this video we'll be making um, square and scratch version 2 it's already been shared this is a reference project and i would like to give a shout out to fearing 25 firewall because he asked me like teach me how to do this and um, yeah so i had told him that will be on the youtube channel and he said oh really nice so uh please uh, follow this man please uh he had asked a very good question because of the uh, more log section hey, please here let's start let's go on the create option and please follow him uh, he, he, he deserves your follow um here we go so first off let's name it square and scratch version 2 tutorial tutorial okay so now first off first thing what we're going to do is that we'll get this scratch sprite sorry about that uh then we will set its size to 50 because we don't want it to be that big so let's have a look amazing oh let's do 25 yeah this looks a bit better if you do full screen yeah fine now Click on this option for the extension, the pen extension here, as you can see this is the pen extension, let's go back, first thing we have already done when the green flag is clicked, so I'll again do this another function, so because this is uh, function 1, we can put this in comments called function 1, okay, which is the size one, so you can add comment, to size, I won't exactly add the comment, but in case you're beginning with the pen extension, then I would recommend you to do that. Now, my blocks. Go in this section. I haven't covered this section, but let's see. So, as you make a block, okay? So, you come on uh, this option. So, I'm going to run without screen refresh because um, we don't have to read this. Okay. Uh, actually, I won't really just tell the definition because uh it will be in the description i'll make sure it goes in the description so in case you feel like why is he said that go in the description okay so first thing what we're going to do is that i'll name it square uh so uh, let me just explain this in brief actually run without screen refresh it means that it will run without a screen refresh so no control r so um it was very like tough for a scratch to get this function okay but uh detailed explanation is in the description so when the green flag is clicked square okay now define square because the uh, uh, scratch does not know like what is the square function so we are going to define it over here now first thing what we'll do is for repeat 10 we want to repeat 10 we are going to repeat 4 which is sides so we can put a variable sides and then again we can do set sides to four and i will actually just do that repeat sides uh, this will actually be a bit detailed for you like you can understand easily then it's two uh, left turn then again we're going to do set left turn to 90 so this will actually help you memorize how you can like how you can uh, use this so usually scratch is also taught in schools so um, it will actually very help you uh, these variables so it's like okay you know what a square has four sides so winning sides of a shape is this is this so it will really help you uh, it actually helped me also so um want to do turn left anti-clockwise also yeah it's anti-clockwise left turn or anti-clockwise turn you can name it according to your preference or you can just keep it also 90 degrees um yeah so then turn left turn and then move 100 steps i don't think i have to really explain that but in case you want to do then i'll just do it for you so you can just do this 100, not 200, 100. and uh the reason why i do 100 is because if we take a grid let me just go in the backdrop and get the grid backdrop I'll get this 20px one. I, I've actually memorized how it looks like. So let me go here. Zoom in. So this is 20px. 
So that means it will move this much and that will be like this much. And 10 steps is actually very less. So um, I won't really recommend you to do 10 steps. But in case you want to do, then go ahead. Curiosity is not a crime. So uh, move 100 steps, then you will turn left on. So let's. And here's another thing just to wait one second. Actually, one second is also a lot. And uh, scratch <laughs> when you are into programming, one second gets a lot. So, what we'll do is 0.5, meaning uh, like at a blink of an eye, kind of. Yeah. So, let's see. Oh, wait. Actually, you know, there's one mistake. This is what I made this mistake. I'm very sorry about that. We forgot to use the pen extension here. We'll do erase all because we need all the traces to go. And then pen down over here. Okay. So let's have a look. Does this nice amazing? Goes amazing, and that's the square in Scratch. We'll share it. Uh, also, this uh, project link is in the description in case you need it. But the explanation will not be there, so that's why. Please share this with your friends, and because like in case you have, because uh, I think exams are near. I mean, in twenty twenty three. Um, a lot of my friends also have these exams, so um, it will also help you in exams also. But here's another thing: if you use this, perhaps in exams or anywhere, like if you have you know coding practicals, then if you do this also, um, I think it's, it's okay. But in case you even like just do this about ninety and all, then also it will be okay. Like you're just using variables; it's nice. And but in case you do, but if you do the square block. Well, I guess you'll be your teacher's favorite student. Okay. Yeah. So, yes. That's all for this video. Subscribe. And, uh, yeah. And also tell your friends to subscribe. It really helps me.